Good morning. Hello. Good morning from Katowice. Uh, we are here. We uh, we arrived yesterday a little a little later. Uh, it was around nine nine p.m. or so. A nice long bus ride, uh, but it was a good time. It was a good time. So last time we spoke, um, I was heading out to CD Project Red to. Uh, to uh, to meet up with everybody that I hadn't seen yet, and uh, of course to um, sorry, there's a lot of weird noises happening around right here. It's 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 oddly quiet in this hotel. It seems to make sense, but at the same time, it doesn't make sense. So uh, yeah, we met up with everybody yesterday at CD Project Red. So uh, by the end of the tour, and by the time everybody was sitting down and everybody had arrived. Um, all the competitors were, were present, of course, and, uh, and uh, Garuna was also there, and Swim was also there as well. Um, I got a chance to, uh, to meet uh, PPD, who's a very cool guy, life coach and, uh, and wife coach. Also very cool, very nice to talk to. Uh, ended up having lunch with Trump and Noxious and Lothar, who was, I was a surprise to see him there, um, but he is casting the Polish side of the tournament with Paul Berza. Uh, on uh, on on the big day, which is tomorrow, and uh, right now we're just getting ready for our dress rehearsal. Uh, I'll be leaving here in almost an hour, so hopefully I have time to upload this video. It might be a, it might be a quicker one, but it was really great. We got to get a tour of CD Project Grid Studios. It was my second time doing that, but they had a lot of construction that had finished. It's one of the nicest gaming studios, I think. A lot of people were saying that. I can only I can only really uh, comment on on that, that it was nice. I can't compare it to another gaming studio. I can compare it to other like big, big studios. I've been to Google and I've been to, uh, you know, a lot of like major like kind of network, like very fancy offices, but CD Projekt Red has probably one of the coolest offices I have ever seen, straight up. And I've been to a lot of offices in my life, so I'll say that. I'll say that much for sure. And uh, I just wanna say thanks so much for the outpouring of support, everybody who's been uh, sending messages about this whole event and like kind of keeping up with me on Discord when I've had reception on the way here and uh, you know all the jokes and stuff that I've been seeing and also all the birthday wishes because today's my birthday yeah and uh, you know it's uh, it's got to be one of the craziest uh, ways to start uh, a year I suppose if you want to look at it like that so yeah we did the whole CD Project Red thing and um, yeah we, we got to play a little Gwent. We got to talk a lot about Gwent. You guys should be excited. It's going to be good stuff. It's going to be good stuff coming for the future of Gwent. That's all I can say. But it's going to be... It's it's just... It's a nice kind of refreshing reminder that, that a really, really strong and good gaming company that gives a shit is making this game. So... So it's looking so good. It's looking so good. And uh, post-Challenger, I think uh, a lot of stuff is going to be coming out. So, but yeah, the name of the game right now is Challenger, and uh, the Challenger tournament is, uh, we're getting ready. I'm going to the, to the dress rehearsal today. I'm leaving with, uh, with my people, um, the casters and the players, and uh, uh, of course, Joshua Gray, who, uh, who I've been talking to for a number of weeks now. Very good guy. Um, he's here, and uh, he was on the bus as well, and it was good to meet him, and Maud Garrett. Great to meet her as well. She's awesome. Um, she's very funny. And uh, who else? And on the way, on the way, on the trip over, um, I spent the trip kind of. It was in two halves. The first half, I was I was with uh, the Chinese casting team as well as Swim and Vishra, and uh, and then later on, I was sitting with Seraxia, who's a great guy as well. Dude, six eight, very tall, and uh, as well as uh, Bannon. The, he was the uh, CD Projekt Red. Um, he was the guy who was in that video that they posted where I was arriving with Vischer and Trump from the airport, which I actually just watched uh, just like before bed last night. It actually, it's funny. I didn't, didn't feel like I was in that video, but like, because I was there and it didn't seem like there was a lot happening, but there was, there was some of the camera there and they did a great job. They cut that really nicely. It looked really good. And uh, yeah, yeah, that was, that was great. But at no point did I feel like, okay, for the video, we're doing this, except for that one shot where we're walking out of the airport. That was, like, the only one. Otherwise, it was just, like, we were just hanging out. So that was great. And, um, yeah, the bus ride over was, was kind of long, four hours. I was getting really sleepy. The jet lag's, 
the jet lag gets to you, it doesn't matter really how much you sleep, I think it's just kind of tiring sometimes. So hopefully I don't feel that tired today, and hopefully I don't feel tired tomorrow. Um, I won't feel tired tomorrow. I'll be too pumped. I'll be too revved up. But uh, here we are in Katowice. Let's see if my phone can handle this one. I mean, there's not much. This, this is a very modest hotel, and this is a different, uh, yeah, you can see. I can, I can actually check to see. It's raining today. It's a little wet, and uh, I'm on, like, you know, only on the second floor. And, uh, you know, it's a... It's a modest, modest mining city, and uh, but no, we have a nice little hotel here. It's it's not quite you know the swankiness of, of the other one, but like this is the whole hotel. This is it here. My unmade bed is somewhere behind me. Yes, and uh, yeah, that's the story. So I'm gonna get some breakfast, and I think there's gonna be some stuff happening tonight. I think someone's gonna fire up a stream so we can chat more. But I just want to say, once again, thank you so much for the support. The support. Thanks for keeping up with me. Thanks for the birthday wishes. And uh, this dress rehearsal is going to start to feel really real. And um, I'm, I'm really excited. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm, uh, I need to eat some food, I think. I think the excitement's going to cripple me if I don't eat some food. So talk to you soon. And every time I make one of these things, I feel like I forgot really something really important to say. So I just really wanted to highlight the thank you for the support. I'm just nothing without you guys. And uh, it just means so much to me that you guys uh, want to follow the stuff that I'm doing. Because uh, uh, it's just been surreal. It's been just absolutely surreal being around all of these people for something so huge. So somebody's knocking at my door, so I'm going to cut this video off. Uh, take care, folks.